coffee to Lala Latte. I don't even know where to start. It's very life changing. This is LA core. Best Einspanner. We got so many good goodies. Oh, the red yeah, 40 yeah. and the blue. Oh. What? This is good. Oh. Honestly, this is such a vibe. Look. Sugar is sweet. The world does a sleep when you fall in a pile. And once in a while. Hi, how are ya? Welcome to LA. Vibes are good. It's a little cloudy, so I'm hoping that the sun comes out later. We're gonna be starting our LA trip now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We're here for Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Three days. Drove down last night, as you know. Today, we're gonna go to a coffee shop, do some work because I still haven't finished editing the vlog, as usual. <laughs> and then after that, do some shopping, go to another coffee shop. <laughs> and get some dinner and we'll see where the day uh takes us in between all of those activities commencing our la trip now i forgot to give you guys the fit check how rude of me oh Cezanne sweater that i've been wearing every single day for the past three weeks i'm sorry it's just really cute so i have, just have to wear it you know i have an arizona t-shirt underneath for layering and then heat tack under long sleeve because this is like slightly itchy i have really sensitive skin so it's like very very slightly itchy and it bothers me anyway and then my pool house jeans that i've also been wearing for the past two months so <laughs> um and then puffer tote from joy a little i feel like i wore this exact same outfit in my last video Ooh. but it's fine it's a good outfit okay that I'm doing it's like painful I don't know like I can't like bend it or else it really really hurts and I don't know why well, let's show the people it's finally sunny what time is it it's 12 30 and it's sunny kind of but anyway I'm very hungry so it's time to go eat some food I think we're gonna go to the Grove probably I'm not sure though I kind of want your one I kind of want something like hot though like pasta sisters I'm hungry I'm hungry. We'll see. Guys, I found these cute little things and I, I want it. Never mind. It was a cat litter box thingy and not cute for my room. Maybe for Beanie, but we're gonna pass on this one. One strawberry blaze smoothie. One? Yeah, just one. And then can we also pay for these here as well? <laughs> Round two. We also got sushi and some like meat combo thing. Let me show you the spread. Can you open this? Thank you, thank you. Strawberry glaze smoothie, chef special sushi, some meat combo thing with broccolini, buffalo, cauliflower, and carne asada. Slay. Looks so good. Okay, this is John's first time trying the smoothie, so here you try it first. Is it good? Okay. It's a candy. <laughs> good fire. 
food review time. Hailey Bieber smoothie fire as always. It's super rich, so I can never really finish it myself, but very tasty. And this is my first time trying the sushi and it's called Chef Special, which doesn't really tell me anything about what's in it, but it's basically just a salmon nigiri with jalapeno and garlic chips. It was all right, nothing special. Moving on to the meat combo. Buffalo cauliflower was okay. Everyone hyped this one up on TikTok, but TBH, it's whatever. We also got the grass-fed beef with chimichurri sauce and it was super yummy, simple, but hella flavorful. Broccolini was also very yum, but pretty standard for a veggie in my opinion. I'm trying to get an iPad so I can make my thumbnails. Not sure if I want an iPad Air or iPad Mini or the iPad Pro. We don't know. But so far, this one's really cute. Wait, there's a silver version of this. She's cute. Cafe de Lulu. Cafe de Lulius. Cafe de Lulia. Literally so cute. Wait, it's a little bear. Oh my god. Cafe de Lolo. Cafe de Lolo. Lolo. Cafe de Lolo. Okay. I want to put this like, in an inconspicuous area, but this is like really not inconspicuous. Oh, it's fine. I'm with Oli. Okay, shall we try it? Viennese coffee cafe de la la latte. <laughs> that was the most fire coffee in the entire world especially that cream that was like amazingly amazing so yummy so yummy <sighs> this is you john oh like let me get some of the cauliflower <laughs> that was you erwan oh Broccolini. <laughs> 30 minutes for five miles. Only in LA, hashtag LA, hashtag LA things. Yay, going to dinner, going to dinner. Chanto. Okay, we're back at Cento for the second time because it was so good the first time I went a few months ago. I wanted to try some new things, so we got the octopus, and this one was fire. The texture was crispy but chewy at the same time and perfectly smoky. <laughs> and you know we had to get the spicy pomodoro because it's a literal staple. Oh my god. And just it's just always just so good. And then John ordered the rack of lamb because if lamb has one fan, it's him. This one was honestly so good. I mean, like for how expensive it was, it really better be good because girl, she was hefty. But the vibes are always good. I love it. It's so casual. It's so cute. And food is really good too. We honestly just have a good time every time we're here. And then we finally ended the night with their ice cream cookie dessert. Very rich, very decadent, but in my opinion, not as good as the banana tiramisu because Ooh, it is really sweet. I think we should eat her big cookie. Add more sugar with the cookie. <laughs> It's currently Friday. I'm getting ready. It's 8.30 in the morning, but I have an appointment today. I'm gonna go get my eyebrows microbladed again. I had it done a year ago. Now I need a annual refresher. The place that I go get microbladed is called Studio Sashiko. A little about the microblading experience. I'm gonna film everything so you can see. But basically, I got my first microblading two years ago and Shaughnessy is literally the most amazing microblading artist. This is my brows without any makeup on. And like, this is what my brows used to look like without any makeup on yeah i hate that like blocky brow look that's why i really 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 recommend her i just feel better when i don't have makeup on because before like i, I would look like a naked roll mat and a roll mat ah, mole rat now i wake up and i look like a beautiful princess you know what I'm also today's plan we're meeting up with some friends for dinner and top golf i've never done top golf before but it's okay i'll learn this morning is very cloudy 
grow my hair. What the heck? Anyway, as you can see, it's quite cloudy. So yeah, this is the vibe. <laughs> I'm gonna quickly do my makeup, finish getting ready, and then we'll be on our way. And I'll see you at the cafe. memory look no one is here which is kind of nice but i got a vienna einspanner decaf <laughs> because i can't have caffeine before my appointment anyway let's do a little taste test shall we looks really good look at the cream it looks so good mm. patience sir oh it's really good wait loki i think the cream on this one i think cafe de lala cream is better but this is really good cheers it's pretty good yeah do you like cafe de lala better though cafe de lala is fire wait i forgot to give you guys a fit check full house jeans brandy melville t-shirt abercrombie cardigan as usual um excuse oh, me <sighs> um next time can you try to drink like in the same place that i drink yeah thanks I'll love. I'll yeah, love. I'll love. I'll love. <laughs> getting dinner. I mean, no, getting lunch or brunch at Lou's Cafe. Some Taiwanese breakfast. It's gonna be so yummy. I'm so excited. Doing a little walk. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> no, you love me. No, you care. Just show whenever. A braised pork belly and a Hong Kong milk tea. I don't even know where to start. <laughs> He's gonna mix it up. Okay, this place was such a lovely surprise. It was so adorable inside and very comforting. The chicken rice was a win, but I wish it was a little less oily. And I feel like the pickled radishes didn't really go with the dish. And then the braised pork belly was not my favorite, but John liked it. It was a little too rich for me. And I feel like the cucumbers were a tad too vinegary, but overall I liked the vibes and the food reminded me of home. I think there could be a few adjustments made though. Yay, we're finally at Studio Seishiko. This is where I get my brows done, and my artist's name is Shaughnessy, and she's also the co-owner of the place, which is so girl boss of her. We first started off by mapping out my brows. I wanted to go for the same shape, but slightly more lifted than before. Shaughnessy really took her time to shape them exactly how I like, and so I always feel confident that she really cares about what I want while making sure they still suit my face. Honestly, like I think it's very life-changing. So, like when I wake up, I'm like, oh wow, like I look so good. <laughs> That's why I kind of wanted to do it a little fuller than last time. I'm still thinking because like I do my makeup more often now. So now it's like, okay, like it'll be nice to just not have to fill in anything. You could definitely take it up or not. Okay. Like it's crazy. Yeah. And we'll, we'll do baby steps still. We'll do steps. After we nailed down the look that I wanted, she put on numbing cream on and this stuff works like magic, guys. I literally do not feel a thing at all when she starts tattooing. Like, I barely have footage of the process because I fell asleep. I mean, it was it was just so relaxing. I couldn't feel any pain at all. I would say that if I did feel pain, it would feel like a tiny, tiny cat scratch. The whole process took about two hours total and I'm so in love with my results. Make sure to check out Studio Sashiko and hit up my girl Shaughnessy for the dream brow of your life. Finished results. <gasps> I'm not gonna show you. <laughs> I want to see your reaction. Okay, ready? Okay. Looks good. Whoa. Wait, I don't. Wait, what do you mean? 
What do you mean, what do you mean? Does it look good? It does. <laughs> <laughs> it looks really good. Yeah, it's like fleeks of fleeks. Hi guys! We're in Little Tokyo. Oh wait, we gotta pay for parking. Oopsies. This is LA Core. Anyway, there's this matcha place and apparently their matcha is fire. One of the best matchas that you can get in LA. And honestly, I believe it because it's in Little Tokyo. So I feel like might as well get it from the source, you know what I mean? Do a little taste test. This is a matcha oat latte. Girl, mix her up real good. The color is good. This is also really big. I wasn't expecting this. Mmm. Mm -hmm. It's really good. It's not too sweet, yeah. Eyebrows <laughs> on fleek. Yo, they're actually like sting kind of quite a bit. So I'm gonna be in a little bit of pain tonight, but it's okay because beauty is pain. So it's currently 5 p.m. and guess where we're going? Cafe de Lala again. It was so good yesterday that I just really want it again. And I want to try the matcha version. So I will see you at the cafe. Tell them what happened, tell them guys, what guess what? Look, we went in wanting to get one little matcha drink, and now we have two. One of the baristas accidentally made the drink into a coffee, but then he was like, Oh, you guys can just keep it. You guys yeah. just keep it because we're just gonna throw it away anyway. So, and I was like, <laughs> For me? <laughs> okay, of course. I'm not gonna say no to coffee, and honestly, like the coffee one low key might be better. Ooh. The espresso they use is so good. But anyway, honestly, best Einspanner at Cafe de Lala on 3rd Street. It's so good. Like, so good. Anyway, we're at the Goodwill parking lot. Just sipping our drinks before we go in. Had to hit the thrift store before we leave LA tomorrow. You know the vibe. So hopefully the thrift gods are, are going to be uh, in our favor today. Mm -hmm. That's what you got to do to look good, so... Uh oh, he's gonna take all the good stuff. Let's go. Oh my god. The competition is here! stuff 25 dollars with a 20 percent off slay amazing we got so many good goodies girly we're walking to the pocha and it's kind of sprinkling but it's fine the place that we're going to is like uh only like a nine minute walk so instead of driving we're gonna walk because parking is so bad in k-town oh it's also really cold <laughs>
that I got time for shit Honestly, we're just probably gonna grab coffee and food and then go back up. It's raining so much. Look, can you even see? Look at that. Yeah, it's it's raining hard on our last day, which is honestly nice because I'm glad it didn't rain earlier. It's time to grab some coffee, some food, and enjoy the last few hours we have. Ah. Uh. I'm honestly ready to go home and just like sleep in my own bed at this point. Oh wait, also like look at my eyebrows. This is like what almost 24 hours after my appointment. They're like a little red. They're a little scabby and bloody, but they're okay. They hurt a little bit, like stinging a little bit, but not as bad as yesterday. But yeah, that's the vibe. I like my fit today. It's giving like, you know. <laughs> you know, like, I just need some like gentle monster sunglasses would just like complete the fit you know what i'm saying but anyway we'll see you at the cafe why thank you why thank you sir <laughs> okay i'm good i have a hood that's what i said i was like it's not raining anymore last coffee of la i'm so sad <laughs> This is the angel me latte. Oh. What is this Wait, like? what? You know, I've never had angel me. This is good. Mmm. It kind of has like a nutty, roasty, roasted flavor. I feel like if you like hojita, this is really good. Mmm. Fire. Fire! Anyway, as I. Oh, wait. Let me put the coffee into the frame so it's like the vibe, you know? Like, it's LA and it's coffee and it's. Beautiful. We're gonna go grab some lunch, brunch, whatever, at this place called Perilla. I think it's like, it's like a to-go thing, so we can grab it and eat in the car before we drive back up home. We had to grab some good, good food before we leave, of course. You know the vibes. Always drinking coffee and eating food. I'm gonna need to pee on the way up, low key. Wait, you know what this tastes like? You know like the corn pops? Like oh, like the cereal? No, pop cereal. Oh, pops, yes. Does it taste like that? It tastes like that. It's fire. It's fire. It's fire. I love it. It's so good. Yay! Yeah, where is this place? Oh, we found it. Okay guys, we got our little perilla bag. Let's see what we have. John got the beef and then I got the cod. Has I love fish. Let's open her up. Oh, it's yummy. Oh, wait, mine looks fire. What? How come yours comes with so much stuff? <gasps> guys, this looks so good. <laughs> Gotta get a pick for the gram. Gotta pick for the gram. Quiet in, quiet in. Wait, yours looks really good. Like yeah, I know. <laughs> anyway. Ooh. Look at that. Oh my god. Mmm. Oh my god. Mm-hmm. 
The view is so nice. Like, honestly, this is such a vibe. Look, we're just eating and we got a view of downtown. It's so pretty. Anyway, this marks our last meal in LA. Amazing, perfect way to end the trip. And it's just fabulous, right? It's fabulous. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I'll see you next week in next week's vlog. Love you, bye. Mm -hmm.